What was meant to be a day of jubilant return of the five-star general Miguna Miguna turned into a day of humiliation and consternation. After the self-declared NRM, general was barred from boarding a flight from Germany this morning. The lawyer who was expected in the country this evening once again found himself on the receiving end, saying that he had been barred from boarding his flight and blamed the government for his wars. They, don't, they really don't care if I fly to Europe or any other Africa or any other uh, country in the world. What the regime in Kenya does not want is for me to be able to travel to Kenya. The captain cannot fly. Put that down. Put that down. The captain cannot fly. The red alert which was issued two years ago bars Miguna from accessing Kenya or any other African country. But Miguna maintains that the red alert was issued Monday. Matiangi cannot disobey court orders. This flagrant abuse of power and disobedience of court orders is coming right at the top. However, the government spokesman, Colonel Cyrus Aguna, maintained that Miguna is free to travel back home, adding the Ministry of Foreign Affairs was looking into the matter of the red alert. On its part, Lufthansa Airlines says that Kenyan authority requested that Miguna be denied boarding. Through its Twitter account, the airline said that it is trying to help him in whatever way it can. For now, Miguna remains holed up at the TLX airport even as his lead lawyer John Haminwa this evening wrote a protest letter to the Ministry of Interior regarding the fate of his client. On my part, I've tried to get in touch with the Director of Immigration to give me an explanation, I have not succeeded. I have also tried to get in touch with the Cabinet Secretary in charge of internal security. I have not been able to get him on phone at all. I remain optimistic that uh, Dr. Miguna will return to the country and that um, we will get more information from the government as regards this red alert that has been levied on Lufthansa Airways. Haminwa also condemned the government for ignoring seven orders issued by various courts about his clients, the latest having been issued by Justice Weldon Courier Monday. Dr. Miguna was to come and uh, attend uh, uh, a funeral of his close relative who has died. Um, there's no reason why he should not be allowed to come back to the country at all. It is absolutely wrong not to allow him to come to the country. The captain cannot fly! Put that down! The captain cannot fly! Put that phone down! The captain cannot fly! Miguna was deported in March 2018 after a mock swearing-in of opposition chief Raila Odinga as people's president and has remained one of the government's fiercest critics. Lennox Sengre, K24 TV.